This sells for over $80 and it comes with a tray with it. Welcome back. Today I am at the Salvation Army. Hopefully we can find something to resell on eBay. And after this I have to make sure I go to the post office. Got some packages in my Ikea bag. <laughs> Alright, let's get inside. Alright, well there's not too many people here but should be able to get a cart. Alright, let's start over here. Ooh. We have a green vase like this. Oh, it's $10. I wonder what the colors are. Yellow, white, and pink. And white is $1. This is a little bit newer. I thought maybe in Poli. Yeah, you can tell the way it's made. It's hollow right there. I think the Empoli is hollow, but that has a hole in it. Huh. More bar barbecue um, plates. Oh, what does that say on the bottom? Made in USA. That's kind of cool. Put your wieners and patties there. FTD. Syracuse, China. Hmm. And we have a penny. There's that Asian decanter. We got this little guy. Oh, it's a bell. <laughs> oh, a Parmesan. Made in China. You get two. With chips. All right, these are hand painted. We had a um, tumble up like this. It took forever to sell. <laughs> that? I like the roses. Those are transferred. Probably looked at that before. Those look like they could be Pier 1. Looks like I'm um, Italian. Hmm. $2.99 each. Ah, oh, that's a lot of... One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. That's probably FTD. Hey, look at these. These look like, um... Either Libby or Indiana Glass. Not that one. I like the Christmas ones with the Holly Berry. It's Hallmark. It's a big mug. <laughs> Let's see what this is. Looks like one of those fishes that you hang in the bathroom. Is, is there just one? Yeah, there's a crack. How much is that? 99 cents. It's not that noticeable. I think I'll still get it with a crack. Huh, that's a good find. It's a made in Japan mug. The Temptations. Those are $2 each. Oh, that looks like a made in Italy basket. Let me back up. That one's not. I don't want to knock anything over. A little bit of chips. Made in Italy for $2. Any bit of damage on the yellow flower, but I think I'll still get it. Not bad. I couldn't find a cart. Let me see if there's one now. All right, let's see what we have in the figurines. Oh, look at these cute mice. Oh, made in Taiwan. Um, 
what is that called? Jasco. Jasco, I got it right. <laughs> Those are cute, but not too much resale value there. What about this owl? Put you right in there. Ooh, this one's pretty. Look at the butterfly and the flower. That's only $2. Let me peel that. All right, so it says YH 1997. I don't see any damage. I think I might get it for $2. What else is there? All these vases. Nothing's really popping out to me. About this lady. Oh, look at this pig. <laughs> July. Oh, it has a birthstone on there too. That's cute. Don't break. Okay. Um, it's the. It's made, I think this made to look like Hummel. Yeah. Let's take a look at this turkey. Looks like an art project, maybe. That's oh, a little planter. I like that. <laughs> what about these? Technique. Let's see if this is Mackenzie Child. No. Nothing in there. We have some Tupperware. Put your cake in there. How much is that? $3.99. It's not half off. I keep forgetting what the colors are. I keep looking at that. All right. Let's see if there's anything new. This looks like Mexican. That's Treasure Craft. How much is that? $4.99. The 1980s plate Optima. I always tell by that weird design. They have the San Miguel. I mean, that's half off. $4.99. Look at that for $2.50. It is kind of heavy, but I never see this type of red. We have an uh, apple. <laughs> Those are still two ninety nine. I always love Christmas stuff. Where is that from? Rite Aid, maybe. Oh, odds and ends. <laughs> I always like to see where um, that was old stuff like that where it was sold. Have a gravy boat, linen and things. Oh, look at these crazy pumpkins. <laughs> Corel. Have an old crock. A big crack in it. Made in China. I wonder if that was supposed to have a lid. All right, let's take a look at these vintage, um, I believe they call that the trigger, trigger mug. It's Man Imports, 1967, but they're $3 each. I feel like they're probably worth like $8 each. Down here we have a Federal Glass. Oh, Fire King. Man, it has to have all the scratches in there. I always love that. I think they call that color the peach. You have the Pyrex for $8. The tea mug. 
have some Wemmicks. It's five dollars. I always have trouble selling this kind of Lennox with a gold rim. It takes forever to sell for me. Alright, down here we have one of the Fenton shoes with a cat on the front. How much is that? Three dollars. It's worth about ten. Uh, twelve dollars, I would say. Let me get my stuff. Alright, over here we have a little pink rabbit on a nest. I think that's what you call it. I was thinking maybe Fenton, but I don't think so for... It's probably worth about $10. We have this vase over here. Hmm. First I thought maybe Hager. This big crack in it too for $8. We have a flower frog. $12, yellow and gold. Looks like it would be Hall. That would be Mark, though. I'm trying to find some Catherine Holmes enamel works. If you find that, it's not marked and it's worth a lot of money. What about this orange pot? Hmm. Feels like it's good quality. Maybe made in 1960s. $5.99. Oh, wait, what about this one? Oh, West Bend. <laughs> That's 70s. We usually could find something in the wood section. Uh, Ruba. Those are neat. Ooh, look at this frog with a peace sign. Peace frogs. <laughs> Westland. It's two ninety nine. Japan. Ooh. Oh my god. I want someone to rub that on my back right now. <laughs> Ooh, I had to walk all the way up to the other side of the street. Start in the garage. Hey, we get the latch hook rug. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, there's an owl. I might see how much these are. I would get the owl. I wish it had mushrooms on it. All right, I didn't see anything else in the garage. Let's go inside. Dad, Dad the price of a floor and stuff. Out of the wall here. Okay. All the floors in here take me right as a. Yeah. Goofus glass. Thirty-five. Ooh, look at the wallpaper. Where to start? Ah, well, let's take a look at all the roosters. Ooh, oh, look at the red one. Oh, and the blue. Ooh, hold on, I see more. Now for 35. This is the first day, so let's see if that's Murano. It is not. It's pretty, though. I love it. Oh, look at the white one. The cold paint. I always like the small ones. There's Murano. Yep. Hand painted. Oh, it's Jordan Import. It's for 60. Oh, look at this one. That's a music box. Berman Anderson. <laughs> the red one's 35. This one's different. This one is 17. I never saw one with paint on it like that. It says as is. 
know where it is. I don't know who made it. I wonder if somebody just painted that or it was made like that. I don't see the damage. Maybe as is is the paint. Don't know. Oh, we have a pottery. Oh yeah, that's heavy. It's only 35. Oh, it's Cracker Barrel. That one I might have to look up. All right, well, that sells for about that price, so I'm gonna have to leave it. Um, oh, look how cute this room is. Huh. Let's see how much that is, 65. It's crystal. This one um, was made in the 1960s. All right, I see some cute stuff in here. Ooh, look at this cat. Looks like a slag glass. I almost feel like this one is Westmoreland. I'm 17 is about right. Ooh, look at this cat trinket dish. Oh, it's made in China. Ooh, look at that. I love it. See if I could open it up. I so wish it was Limoges. This looks like a Italian Capodimonte. I think that's a replica, though. What about these cats? Oh, it's a teapot. Made in China. These look like Capodimonte. No, it's Japan. Ooh, I've seen this before. Now, can I remember who made it? I don't know, it's a green satin. Oop, let me get a grip on it. There's a lady sitting on top. I don't know where my memory is. <laughs> $20. Alright, so I did the Google lens on this. This is Smith Glass. It's worth about $40 to $50. Um, so maybe I'll come back here when it's half off day and get it. About this doll. <laughs> Nutcracker series. Look at her face. Oh, I didn't realize this is, um, Buyer's Choice. Buyer's Choice, 1995, and it comes with a piano. How much is this? 45. I wonder how much... I never saw a set like this before, though. Comes with a piano. I feel like this is worth more than 45 maybe like 100 all right there's people that have it listed for 40 up to 150 <laughs> so i'm gonna leave it all right well i spotted this three dollars each for the stuffed animals i was looking at this one Deville, New York, New York. Ooh, I might get these for three dollars. Let me look at the other one. Ah, it has a pin on it. They're cute. I don't see any damage either. I'm gonna get these. What else do we have? Ah. That was sticky. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All 
All right, I think I'm gonna stick with these two. Okay, so I just looked up this up. This is Corning where, I'm not sure what um, country or city that is, but this, oh, this sells for over $80 and it comes with a tray with it. So I'm gonna get that. All right, I made a quick stop at Goodwill. Um, I didn't film there because I only had like a half hour to shop, so I had to go around quickly and try to find something. Um, first thing, I found this mid-century modern decanter with five of the glasses. I'm trying to figure out what kind of liquor you would drink out of that. <laughs> Look how small they are. <laughs> um, I had a hard time getting this cork out. I thought it was going to break when I was pulling it out. But there's the bottom. I'm not sure who made it. Um, and then I found these cute mid-century... Um, Salt and pepper shakers. Look at the eyes, the rhinestones. I love finding stuff like that with the rhinestone eyes. I paid $5 for those and $8 for the decanter. And there's the fishy. I wish I had the whole set of this. Um, it would have another fish with it with bubbles. I believe Norcrest made this. It's worth a lot more than what I thought. And then I got this hand-carved... Um, I believe that's Indian or African. I'm not sure. But I paid $4.99 for that. I feel like that would sell for about $30 to $40. And then I got this Radon Jingle Mug. Um, I got that at a yard sale. I believe I paid less than a dollar for it. So I'm going to list it for about $10 to $12. Probably $10. All right, well, that is it for this video. I'm gonna go try to list some of these items and don't forget to check out our eBay store, The Thrifting Twins. Uh, we have a link in our description and I'll see you next time. Bye.